What is good y'all, Vardere here and we back for another video. This is going to be a different type of video though since you know this is the day before reset. So I figured I just wanted to relax on PvP for now. Uh, I did actually read God Rank. So yeah, I just, wanted, I just wanted to you know have a quick discussion with you guys. It's probably going to be a shorter, shorter than normal video. Uh, yeah, so I wanted to be talking about this, the, the gauge lock that is found in the game. So courtesy of Spoon, I have his link in the description. Go follow him on Twitter. He does a lot of data mines and everything. He could like... He puts a lot of mods, and it's pretty damn funny, and pretty cool at the same time. So, yeah, go check them out. But, yeah, so if you guys don't remember, I think in my last discussion about the Unique Age, where, like, he found, he's the one that found the the fist icon, if I can find that tweet. Uh, he's, a velo, he's a fellow 21 connoisseur, so, go drop him a follow. But, yeah, um, <laughs> I don't know where it is, like, it was right here, duh. Yeah, he found this, like, initially before... You know, like it was, you know, before Gogeta even came out. Um, so, yeah, yeah, and alongside him finding that, he actually found this, and I know it caught him off guard because, you know, he's like, what the fuck? So, yeah, uh, the gauge lock is exactly as you guys think. Essentially, if they have a unique gauge, um, I guess a character ha will have this ability sooner down the line, where I guess them just doing something, or them just existing, them pressing a card, I don't know. Or their main ability it'll lock the gauge so uh he has a variety of like examples here like there's a chunk of gauge right unblocked so he's getting all this stuff when he's getting hit but when it's locked it's not really whatsoever so that's that's definitely powerful against chunks you know you don't want him to pop his thing um yeah it's just yeah especially against ui like i'm over here thinking about it and he shows it against ui but right here so, to dodge, but guess what? If the gauge is big, big block, he can't dodge. <laughs> That's super busted. And then I feel like this is kind of a—it's not—it's not like a direct counter to Gogeta, you know, like the newly released Ultra Gogeta, because he has like a a newer gauge. But it will definitely stop his combos and like his stacking of sustained damage, cutting kind of damage, and blue cards. But it it won't like solve it. But it's definitely really good against like Trunks here, um, Cell like very good against cell probably it i would say ui is probably the one that gets cut here the most because it's like his whole thing is based on his vanish i mean his, his vanish his unique gauge right because it helps him preserve his vanish more um and then i think cell is like right right there with him because <laughs> you, like every charge that you do is like you're never gonna fill that gauge up like right now it's already kind of hard to fill up cell's gauge if i'm being completely honest with you unless your opponent just lets you sit there and charge or you get a bunch of blasts you know blast charge steps and shit like that but trunks probably also down there too like all the people with unique gauges like are going to be affected for it like they're going to be affected trunks it's going to take them like significantly longer for his gauge to fill up if it's locked consistently so guess what your ult's not going to hit as hard you're not going to get card speed you're not going to get the damage buff it's just uh, and then i'm trying to think like who would they even put this on you know like ultra Gogeta just came out and he's only here for like I want to say a week more um so maybe I, I don't know if like the next lf or something is gonna have this gauge luck or maybe they're just saving it for somebody like a, for, for a bigger event i don't know or this could honestly just be a, an abandoned mechanic i don't know because uh, i know you i don't know if you guys know but spoon has like found like there's a there's a double type advantage thing where it shows like a double arrow let me see if i can find it actually um he showed it not too long ago uh, yeah, like you find all this, blah blah blah. Yeah, double type advantage. So you see that arrow, like right there, right in the combo counter? So that's the, the double arrow thing in the jig. And then right here, double advantage. So it's like the double arrow. It could be abandoned like that. And then if you guys don't know, there's also like the old block mechanic here. Yeah, so that's also like abandoned as well. They know it didn't work pretty fast. So it's obviously good that they patched that out. Well, they didn't patch it out, just, you know, <laughs> they didn't like keep it in. But yeah, I, I do think it's going to come, like, we'll pause, but <laughs> I do think this gauge lock thing will come on, like, a ne next to left, maybe, maybe the next ultra, I don't know, but I'm trying to, I'm trying to, like, think, right, like, how would this work, so, like, every card your opponent uses on you, then, like, what if their kid is like, oh, yeah, every time you use a strike card, it locks their gauge for two counts or something like that, or pop, you pop main, you get damage inflicted, key, you lock their gauge for 10 counts if they have it like it, there's so much things to speculate about like right here he just has like you know, 
Oh, this is locked, right? But it's just, I, I don't know, like, can there be a permanent lock? Like, right here, he has a number of what, 12? Yeah, so this could, this has potential to be like, oh yeah, lock their gauge for 30 counts, like, or t t like 15 counts alone is already crazy. Like, imagine you were, you're using UI, which you shouldn't be. You have UI just chilling there. But guess what? Now that they have their, ga your gauge is locked, you pretty much have to play like a normal character. <laughs> Oh my god, that's gonna be hell. Um, I usually would want like a second viewpoint, but everybody's sleeping right now, and Joku's bitch has didn't respond, so blame him. And Jahudi's just sleeping. Um, but yeah, I just I don't I don't know how they're gonna implement this. If I'm being honest, it, I'm I'm assuming it's just gonna be an LF. Like I I'd I'd completely just believe if you told me like oh yeah, LFZ bro is gonna come. He's gonna have a gauge lock. Uh, or maybe a Janemba, you know, because, you know, counter Gogeta, blah, blah, blah. Because, uh, you know how sometimes they do that. They like, they like implementing new stuff with new stuff as well, if that makes sense, you know. Like, I don't know. But yeah, I just wanted to show you guys one of it. Like, this give you my, I guess, impressions. I think I did part of this in my um, discussion on the, uh, like, the gauge beforehand. Yeah, this one. Uh, the fist thing. Or the, the one that Gogeta has, Ultra Gogeta, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> um, but yeah, I just want to say shout out to Spoon again, and I know today's video is pretty short, it's probably going to be like, what, 5 minutes, 6, uh, 7, uh, uh, something like that, but uh, yeah, hope you guys enjoy this video, be back for the next one, and let me know in the comments if you guys, like, like what are your guys' thoughts on this, like, oh, would you want a specific character to have this, because I know people are going to be like, oh, Jiren's going to come in, you know, have you unique gauge lock, and it's just gonna be correct um, but I do think this mechanic is definitely gonna get like right now it doesn't seem too too impressive because right now there's what four characters in the game that have unique gauges so if a character comes out and there's like oh yeah they counter unique gauges but that's all they do they're not gonna be good right now but in the point in time of the game what, what the fuck am I saying it, later down in the line for the game right when there's like a bajillion units with a unique gauge and that unit's gonna definitely be very good it's just like gogeta 4 like no it like no not just for any character with an anti-revive mechanic right like them coming out right now there's only what a handful of revives but guess what later down the line they're gonna be making more so these are like, these units are gonna stay valuable for that long like cell has the best anti-revive in my opinion uh you have blue boys uh you got trunks you got gogeta 4 um Okay, I'm shipping the, I think is that it? No, there's no way. Oh, Ape Jita is on there. Um, damn, I'm tripping. I think that's it. I don't know. <laughs> but yeah, uh, like I said earlier, hope you guys enjoyed and be back for the next video. And I hope you hope you guys have a damn good one. Adios.